and welcome to Play Matt's Cards, where today we are getting ourselves into a Lord of the Rings Tale of Middle Earth bundle gift edition. Got some awesome pulls in here. Just waiting to come out. We got a uh, guaranteed with our promos the One Ring, which will be awesome. I think they're going for about sixty bucks right about now. So we've got Gandalf. We're at Frodo's birthday party, and uh, Frodo giving his toast. I don't know half of you as much as I should like, and I like less than half of you as much as you deserve. Saucy little toast. And of course, we got the Mount Doom box art. Pretty cool. Lord of the Rings, Tale of Middle Earth. So what kind of goodies we got in here. We have our usual punch outs. We got Gandalf the White, our one 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 plus one counters, little markers, we have the eagle. Right. We should have a land pack. And this has our promos. And we have this amazing spin down. Here's our set symbol. It's usually where the 20 spot is. There we go. Yeah, it's just gorgeous. Honestly, I don't know if it's picking it up, but as always, we have to make sure that it works. And we have a nine. So there you go, that works. And then we have our packs. So with the gift bundle, it comes with one collector booster, which is the only way to get the serialized cards. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and upside down, eight pack. So we'll set this off to the side. Set our awesome box off to the side. Love these, especially when you should crack as many packs as I do. Come in handy. All right. We'll just take a quick look at the ones. These are just the uh, non foil. But just in case you want to see the art. So we got the planes, the islands, swamps. The mountains and our forests. And then on your turn and how to cast spells, blocking, a little bit of introduction on how to play the game. And then here is what everybody's trying to jump on these bundles for. Why I think some LGSs are charging almost 200 for these. I paid $85.99. So we have Frodo, Sauron's Bane. We have Samwise, the Stout-Hearted. And that completes that scene, Mount Doom. Then we have Gollum, Patient Plotter. Loving the foiling in the eyes. And the One Ring, our Mythic. Which is already making its way into just about every deck that is out there. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And then of course, just the foil lands. So put these aside. I haven't decided if I'm gonna sell a set and keep them, because I have a couple of these. Just put those aside, we'll start cracking. But there is still the, uh, the one of one ring was pulled which had the $2 million bounty on it. Um, which was the one ring, but only one was printed with the one of one. Those are art card. Erwin, Fearless Knight. Uh, but it was pulled, but there are still the Soul Ring serialized cards that are still available out there. And we have ourselves a Forest Foil. Last of the Balrog. Nasty End. Sirith. Ungle Patrol, 
Chilt's Ambush, Golem's Bite, Gandalf's Sanction, yep. Council's Deliberation, Stone of Eric, and Oliphant for the uh, full art. Borderless. And Mithril Coat for the rare. Nice. I had one of these in my pre release kit when I played. Oh! And Gandalf the White, Foil Mid Deck. There's a nice hit. Alright. I'm starting off right in a boot token. That's a good way to start the pack off. I think the, uh, the one ring itself is going for almost 60 bucks American. And then, not Smog, the dragon. Oh, this is the Witch King. Yeah, Witch King, Bringer of Ruin, for the art card. And we have ourselves a Swamp, War Beast of Gorgoloth, and I'm gonna mispronounce a lot of these. Uh, surrounded by Orcs, Orcish Medicine, Mordor Muster, Celeborn the Wise, Mirror of Gadriel, Legolas Counter of Kills, Friendly Rivalry, Fire Mirror Field Commander and the uh, Showcase Art, and Shilob, Child of Ungoliant. This is another fun one to play. Um, if you like playing with spiders. And Rohram Lancer or a foil. Nice. And the one ring. So if you ever are playing and you need a marker, you can just bend this. If you need a whoever has the one ring, here's your wing ring bearer. Right there. And you can move it around and then you put your dice on here. To tell you which step you are on. Whenever it says you are tempted by the ring. fun mechanic. A lot of people trying to figure it out on pre-release day. And this should be Saruman the White of many colors. My bad. We have ourselves an island. Banish from an Adorus. Bewitching Leechcraft. Morgul Knife Wound. Bog on the Barrow Downs. Soldier of the Grey Host. The Bath Song. The Grey Havens. Glorenfield, Dauntress Rescuer, The Grey Havens, Legendary Land for Full Art, nice. And Forge Anew for our rare, got our enchantment. And Westfold Rider for our foil. And an Orc Army. You amass quite a bit of Orcs or food tokens, depending on what you're playing in this set, which is nice. This is the envelope one, Bilbo's Ring, the actual card. Don't remember what it's called. We got ourselves a mountain, Hobbit Sting, Pippin's Bravery, Many Partings, Second Breakfast, Lambus, The Mouth of Sauron, Uglic, the, ha uh, the White Hand, Gorbog minus Mogul, Morgul, bleh. Pippin's Bravery. Full art. Hugh the Entwood for a mythic. Nice. Another mythic pull. And Stu the Conies. Smeagol getting bocked. For a foil. And from the list, World at War. A rare. Very nice. Very appropriate for this set. I like how they're uh, making the list actually kind of match up with the theme. The sets they're going into. Ooh, signed art card. That's pretty. Realm Seekers. Get the picture in there. And we have our mountain, the Torment of Gollum, Soothing of Smeagol, Elagur Survivor, Gimli Counter of Kills, Rising of the Day, Shadowfax Lord of Horses. Oath of the Grey Host. Rosy Cotton of South Lane. It's a pretty good card. Um, the Full Art. And for the rare, Ewan Fearless Knight. Full Art. Very nice. Great. And another rare, Legolas Master Archer. Okay. Double. Oh! 
and all of Care Andros for another rare in the foil. Wow. Triple rares? I'll take it. And a human soldier. And if you could, while you're watching, like the video down below if you can hit like. And if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe to the channel and uh, share with your friends. I also stream on Twitch under Playmats at Playmats Cards. Link will be down in the description. Um, I play some Arena, occasionally some Pokemon, just out of boredom. Mary Esquire of Rohan. That's a sick art. Reminds me of the, uh, there was a Templar painting. Um, this reminds me of. And we got a Swamp. Eagles of the North. Escape from Orthanac. Orthan. Orthanac. Uh, isolation of that place. Arwen Un Unamil. Celeborn the Wise. Mirror of Gadriel. Legless Counter of Kills. Go with our Gimli Counter of Kills. Gandalf, Friend of the Shire, and the Showcase Art. And a Nazgul. Yes. This is a. Uh, there are nine of them. They are all, they're uncommons and hard to find and worth quite a bit. They are awesome to play with. This is going into the rare pile just because of the value. And Aragon Company Leader for the actual rare. And Rising of the Day, Full Art Foil. That's pretty epic. And a treasure. We got two packs remaining before we get into our collector booster box. And we got ourselves some more war going on here. Thrill of Possibility. For the art card. We have ourselves a Swampy Foil. Generous Ent. Mushroom Watchdogs. Another good one. A lot of 1 1 counters. Snarling Wolf. Warg. Wolf. Oliphant. Bill Fernie Bree Swindler. Bill the Pony. Gotta get your pony deck on. Stu the Conies. Shire Sheriff. Quick theme upstart end for full art. I had this on my pre release kit. I tried building around this. And Frodo Saron's Bane for the rare. It's an awesome card. Generous Ent for the foil. And from the list, Shatterstorm. All right, got another list pull. Last set booster pack. Let me down, know down in the comments, have you gotten any of these gift bundles? Or even the booster packs? Or were you in on the collector booster mayhem, everybody trying to find the one ring? Let me know how you did down in the comments. We got Sam Wise, Sam Loyal Attendant. Uh, that pan is for whooping golems. Or Smeagles, I should say. We got a Swamp, Shilob's Ambush, Hobbit's Sting, Pippin's Bravery, Many Partings, Stern Scolding, You Cannot Pass, Lost to Legend, Grimma Worm Tongue, nobody likes him, Oliphant in our full art, and for Mythic, Aragon the Unifier. Some commander card. Nice. Ooh, Frodo Baggins for the full art show or the showcase foil. That looks really pretty. And a smog token. Alright. We are looking for serialized soul rings. I will be happy with either the elves, the dwarves, or the nine given to men. Really did a number on these packs. There we go. Try not to put too much pressure on it with the knife because it's a really sharp knife. I just don't want to go all the way through and tear up my cards. To my luck, I'll cut up a serialized card. But, you know, these heavy-duty packs are using, 
really good for protecting it against humidity. I guess when we do box breaks, they don't show up all Pringled. They show up Pringled later. All right, we have Lash of the Balrog. Gimli's Axe. Sam's Desperate Rescue. Really cool card. Brings cards back from the grave. Took Reaper. Danathor, Ruling Steward. Saruman the White. The Forest. Shalib's Child, Ungalant. For our Rare Foil. Call of the Ring for another rare, full art. Galadrum Ambush for the rare. On the commander cards. Elrond, Lord of Rivendale, showcase art. And Faramir, Prince of Ithilin for the showcase rare. Very nice. Voracious Beast, Bell Beast, just about in every pack. And Knights of Dol Am Armroth. Either way, it's cool looking. Full art foil. And Boromir, Warden of the Tower. For a rare to showcase. And a food and tentacle token. So there we go. That is our uh, collector booster. Our, uh, yeah, our gift bundle, I should say. We got the sweet spin down along with it. We got some really cool pulls. But uh, as always, I want to say thank you all so much for watching. Again, if you can hit like, share, subscribe, that'd be awesome. And I hope you all have an awesome day.